Oil analysis is used to understand the presence of wear metals, contaminants, and the condition of the lubricant in an asset. It is proven to be a valuable diagnostic tool, as well as a means to understanding the integrity of equipment and the oil in service. Let's take a quick tour of a typical ALS Tribology laboratory and track a sample being processed. Samples arrive into the laboratory via various courier services. Samples are unpacked and brought over to the sample entry area. The sample is logged in with the drop-off time, date, and other relevant data. Samples are sorted according to client program scope and equipment type to ensure processing efficiency and accuracy. The sample entry department begins the process of logging the samples into the laboratory information management system. Customer information, asset information, as well as oil information is necessary to track the sample and provide accurate diagnostic data. Time on the component and time on the oil is essential information to include with the sample. Samples received with barcodes generated from WebTrieve or submitted through the mobile app are scanned and quickly moved to the laboratory for processing. Samples are visually inspected and any free water, particulate, or exception to appearance is noted. Samples are inverted and kept at laboratory temperature for a minimum of 30 minutes to ensure non-suspended material is redistributed throughout the sample. They are then staged at their first analytical station. Many samples are tested on the Particle Quantifier Index Instrument, or PQI. The PQI analysis detects ferrous wear particles. It is excellent for wear trending when used alongside metals analysis. When PQI is lower than the parts per million in iron from the elemental analysis, chances are there are no particles larger than 10 microns. If the PQI increases dramatically while the parts per million in iron remains consistent or decreases, larger ferrous particles are being generated. Emission spectroscopy is a form of elemental analysis used for determining metal from wear, contamination, and oil additives. Over 20 metals can be quantified down to one part per million. The elemental analysis is quick and the results are highly accurate. Due to the wide range of elements reported and speed of analysis, metals are routine in every lubricant analysis program. Data trending is valuable for determining increase of wear, contamination, a dilution of oils from contamination, or an incorrect oil add. Viscosity is one of the most important tests to run on your lubricating oil. Viscosity is the measurement of a fluid's resistance to flow. The higher the viscosity number, the thicker the oil. The proper viscosity range is critical for ensuring an adequate fluid film for an application between moving parts. The samples are kept in a temperature-controlled bath. Viscosity indicates whether if the oil is within grade or has been contaminated. Water is a common and dangerous contaminant and is the number one cause of equipment failure. A quick determination for water in an oil sample is the crackle test. A hot plate is heated and the sample is poured onto the surface to screen for excessive water contamination. If the sample crackles or bubbles, then excessive water is present. This is then verified by the Carl Fisher analyzer to quantify actual water content. Certain assets are very sensitive to trace amounts of water. For these instances, the Carl Fisher water analyzer is used. This device can measure water down to several parts per million. As oil ages or is stressed, chemical reactions occur which shorten the life of the lubricant. The FTIR can test for the condition of the oil using infrared spectroscopy. Information such as oxidation, nitration, and sulfation can be obtained by FTIR. The FTIR can also determine if the oil, such as engine oil, is contaminated with soot, glycol, and fuel. As oil begins to break down due to heat or contamination stress, acids begin to form. Engine oil manufacturers recognize that engine oils experience these extreme conditions and blend in additives that are designed to neutralize acids as they begin to form. This characteristic is called the alkalinity reserve and is measured using a method called titration. The value the instrument provides are called the base number. As the base number decreases to a condemning limit, an engine oil's useful life is depleted and should be changed. Other oils can generate acid as they are stressed or aged. 
Hydraulic oil, gear oil, turbine oil, and compressor oils can all experience acid generation, which can lead to oxidation and even corrosion. While these oils are not typically formulated with an alkalinity reserve agent due to their service environment and extended service life, it is valuable to monitor acid generation, which correlates with aging and increased oxidation of the lubricant. In these instances, the acid number is tested. Diesel fuel is a common contaminant in engine oil. The presence of diesel fuel may indicate a fuel injection issue or a combustion timing issue. As engine oil is contaminated with fuel, viscosity decreases, thus reducing the protective lubricant film between moving engine parts. A precise method for measuring fuel dilution uses the gas chromatograph, or GC. Once all the testing is completed, the results are sent to the diagnostician for final analysis. The diagnostician will consider the oil, the asset, and the application prior to making a recommendation. Data trending is invaluable for determining wear, contamination, oil condition, or if an incorrect oil is added. The final report is sent to the recipient via email or can be accessed through the WebTree website or mobile app. ALS has the capability to establish report distribution lists based on condition, account hierarchy, or custom lists. Severe results requiring immediate maintenance action will be phoned in to the appropriate contact. ALS offers a wide variety of specialized testing for oil, fuel, and coolant, and we look forward to testing your samples. Please visit ALSglobal.com for additional information about our company and services.